Johnson Controls is pleased to introduce our latest safety innovation. Ansel NFF 3x3 UL201 non-fluorinated alcohol-resistant firefighting foam concentrate for use on hydrocarbon and polar solvent fuel fires. This non-fluorinated firefighting foam concentrate is UL162 listed with various Ansel bladder tanks, proportioners, nozzles, and other discharge devices and delivers effective foam quality at expansion ratios as low as 3 to 1. It is well suited for a variety of firefighting response hazards and for foam systems with type 2 discharge devices. Ansel NFF 3x3 UL201 Foam Concentrate provides class-leading performance for fire knockdown and control, burn-back resistance, and post-extinguishment vapor suppression. This is a video demonstration of the UL162 Type 3 Forceful Application Fire Test for an AFFF on hydrocarbon fuels. This test protocol requires a 50-square-foot test pan containing 2 inches of fresh water topped with 2 inches of heptane. For the start of this test, the foam nozzle is positioned stationary next to the fire test pan. This demonstration shows a side-by-side -side test comparison of a high-quality Ansel 3x3 ARAFFF on the left and the Ansel non-fluorinated 3x3 foam on the right. To initiate the test, the fuel is lit and pre-burned for one minute to heat the pan and fuel prior to foam application. Per the UL162 standard, this test is specifically for fluorinated AFFF concentrates. Non-fluorinated firefighting foam concentrates are UL162 listed under a less challenging protocol that applies foam at a higher rate for a longer period of time. However, this video shows the performance of the Ansel non-fluorinated foam under the more challenging UL162 AFFF test protocol. After the one-minute pre-burn, a 3% foam solution is applied for three minutes at 0.04 gallons per minute per square foot. Foam is applied from the stationary nozzle until control is attained, defined as an approximate 90% reduction in fire intensity. At that point, the firefighter actively applies the foam until it completely covers the fuel surface and extinguishes the fire, and then continues to apply foam and build the foam blanket for the duration of the three minutes. Extinguishment must be achieved within three minutes to pass this standard. The 3x3 ARAFFF achieves control in under a minute. The 3x3 non-fluorinated foam achieves control after a minute 4 seconds of foam application. With active firefighting, the 3x3 ARAFFF extinguishes the fire after 1 minute and 28 seconds. With active firefighting, the 3x3 non-fluorinated foam achieves 99% fire reduction control in under 2 minutes. Then, as is typical with a non-fluorinated foam, sporadic flame candles persist. Full extinguishment is achieved after 2 minutes and 22 seconds of foam application. Per the test protocol, foam continues to be applied even after extinguishment for a full three minutes. 
After three minutes of foam application, the foam blanket on top of the fuel is left undisturbed for 15 minutes. A torch test is conducted twice during this period wherein a lighted torch is passed approximately one inch above the entire foam blanket, including corners, in an attempt to reignite the fuel. Both the ARAFFF and the non-fluorinated foam blankets exhibit no reignition, candles, flame, or flash during these torch tests. After 15 minutes and two torch tests, a stovepipe is placed into the foam blanket about two and a half feet from the sides of the test pan. The stovepipe is set in such a manner as to not disturb the foam blanket. The foam blanket that is enclosed by the stovepipe is removed with as little disturbance as possible to the outer foam blanket. After a third torch test, the fuel inside the stovepipe is ignited and allowed to pre-burn for one minute. After one minute pre-burn, the stovepipe is slowly removed. The fire continues to burn for a five-minute test period to evaluate the burn-back resistance of the foam blanket. After about a minute, the 3x3 ARA Triple F blanketed fire exhibits a quick ghosting flashover and then self extinguishes. This is typical of fast extinguishing A Triple F. The Ansel non-fluorinated foam blanket completely contains the stovepipe flame for the five-minute test duration, demonstrating robust burn-back resistance and vapor suppression. Both of these firefighting foams successfully pass this UL 162 AFFF test protocol. For the Ansolite 3x3 AR AFFF shown, this results in a UL 162 listing with a minimum design application rate of 0.1 gallons per minute per square foot for this fuel application category. This test protocol, however, is not applicable for UL-162 listing of a non-fluorinated firefighting foam. Non-fluorinated foams are tested differently under the UL-162 standard and listed with a higher minimum design application rate of 0.16 gallons per minute per square foot. At this higher minimum application rate, Ansel NF UL201 3x3 non-fluorinated foam provides a greater safety factor than a typical non-fluorinated foam, given its successful demonstrated performance under the lower application rate of the AFFF test protocol. Thank you for your interest in Ansel NFF 3x3 UL201 non-fluorinated firefighting foam concentrate. Please contact your Ansel representative for additional information or visit us at Ansel.com.